first unboxing video. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got a new driver going into the bag today. And uh, pretty excited about it. It's been a while. I'm still rocking the TaylorMade M2. So, uh, yeah, I tested a variety of different clubs, as a good golfer should. I would recommend you do the same. And, uh, yeah, let's unbox this baby, see what we got here. Moment of truth. There it is. PXG Gen 5 driver. We, uh, yeah, I was leaning towards a ping all summer long. And then I demoed a ping and a PXG side by side. And sound, the feel, the look, uh, PXG won me over. So I'm also a huge sucker for a sale. In September, they had those, uh, they, you know, they were pumping out a pretty good sale for their Gen 5 drivers. So this is what we got. Going into the bay, a 60 day trial, which is uh, nice to have. And uh, we get to try it for the months of September, October. My swing's feeling good right now, compared direct to my M2. And we're gonna see how it's performing. So you're getting an unboxing plus a review for the second half of this video. So, got some stickers. We'll look at that later. Feels like Christmas came early, ladies and gentlemen. There she is. Let's pop this out. Toss that down there. Hum dinger. Take a look at that. There's the bottom. We'll get you some beauty shots at the top as well. It's got that dark charcoal look. Standard PXG grip. And so, customize this. We got the, the, the tool here to adjust loft. So we've got a nine degree loft with the Gen 5 0311 driver. We did not go with the XF. The XF is a, a larger face, more forgiving. We've got the Diamina 70 extra stiff shaft. Pretty excited about this shaft. I haven't used this driver with this setup yet. So box contents, of course, you've got the driver uh, with this nice soft leather PXG head cover. As for my game, I will be sticking with my BCGC Hazel Golf Co head cover. Check those guys out. And you've got a nice PXG ball marker. Of course, you've got the tool to adjust loft. And uh, that's the meal deal right there. So yeah, let's head to the range. Give you guys a full in-depth review. Sound, feel, distance, how it compares to my M2, which I've been gaming for five years. And remember, you better be keeping the ball straight. Okay guys, so we're jumping into the review portion of this video. We're starting out with a little bit of warm up with the M2. See if I can hit a few good drives with my stock driver here. Those first two were absolute duck hooks, terrible drives. This third one here, leaked it a little bit right, so kind of overcorrected. Fourth drive, piped it down the middle. Pull out the range finder to try and figure out, okay, what's a good yardage here when I hit that smack dab in the middle with the great swing. We're looking at about 300 yards to the far hedge there, which is where my aim point is. Second drive here, a bit of a miss, a low cut, which isn't gonna hurt you in most rounds. High, kinda cutty slice here, also probably right side rough for most fairways. That one just ballooned off to the right. So the problem with my M2, the misses are big misses. And yes, the good drives are great. Like that one, another absolutely pure drive. Starting out with the PXG, pulled this first drive, so a terrible swing, but it actually wasn't that penalizing. It was kind of straight left. Second drive here, nice high draw. Exactly what we were going for. Third drive here, a bit of a low loopy draw, kind of pulley, not that penalizing. And then this one, ballooned, but not as much as the M2. So a terrible swing, but a reasonable outcome. Another high draw here that would probably land me in that left side rough. Another balloon that's kind of right side fairway. 
um, not too bad and then absolutely smush this drive so pretty straight didn't move a whole lot I find the movement with the PXG is fairly minimal it's either a push or a pull and then maybe you get a five five yard movement based on the swing path after that finishing off with a hand in pocket absolutely pure that last drive and we'll give you a little glimpse of the sound difference between the M2 and the PXG here Okay guys, we're out here today at Harvest Golf Club, which is a great course to build confidence with a new driver. This is the first official round with the PXG. Just had the range sesh, which you saw some specs from. Playing with Badger Ben today. And I can't say I've hit this many fairways in a long time. So the driver's feeling good. And uh, we'll give you a few action clips here as well, just to kind of seal the deal here with this, this PXG. I know I got 60 days to try it out, but we are feeling good. And remember, subscribe. And you better be keeping the ball straight. Do both. Bombs away. You love to see it. Well, everyone, the proof is in the pudding. You saw it right there. The PXG is going in the bag. Didn't even need the full 60 days. I've had it for a couple weeks now and I'm thoroughly enjoying hitting it. All aspects of the driver, the look, the feel, the confidence is there. What more can you ask for with the driver? If it hits fairways and it goes far, we're in good business. In the bag she goes, we'll see you next time.